Hi, my name is David Petter, President and CEO of the Montgomery County Economic Development Corporation. Today I'm in beautiful Rockville, Maryland to meet with Rich Bendis, President and CEO of BioHealth Innovation, where they're fueling the life sciences industry right here in Montgomery County. Let's go learn all about it. Rich, thank you so much for having me here today. Uh, things are going well in the life sciences industry in Montgomery County. Tell me more about what you guys do day to day. BioHealth Innovation, which is a private-public partnership, has been around for about six years now. We were created because there is a gap that exists within this region, which we call the BioHealth Capital Region. And the gap is entrepreneurs, scientists, and small businesses have not had access to all of the resources that they need to grow their businesses. And a lot of them have been research-focused and not as commercialization-focused. BHI, which is private sector governed and run and funded, focuses on market-driven technologies, trying to get uh, the scientists and entrepreneurs better equipped to get their products into the market and determine whether or not there is a market for their products. It sounds like a lot of that's making connections with people, making connections with the thought leaders, with the people who've got capital. How do, you, how do you make those connections happen? Generally, there's a lot of scientists in this region with great technology, research, but they don't know how to get their product to the market. We really fill that gap of how to backfill uh, on providing the resources, access to networks, partners, investors, and non-dilutive funding to help supplement these companies. One of the unique services you have here at BHI is the International Soft Landing Program. Can you tell me more about it? Yes, David. Uh, we believe we have one of the most unique asset bases of any place in the United States with FDA, NIH, and 500 life science companies right here in Montgomery County. So over the last five years, we've been able to attract companies that want to establish their U.S. headquarters here. And you're really offering them business services and guidance to grow their companies. Correct, because they have the great science and we have the business skills to help them enter and be successful in the U.S. So as an economic developer, I'm always excited to know about the innovation happening in Montgomery County. Right. Rockville, 24,000 square feet. There's 28 companies located here primarily focused on technology and life science companies that don't need a wet lab. Germantown's 32,000 square feet, 24 companies are located there. Both Rockville and Germantown are 100% full at this particular point in time. And then Silver Spring is a general innovation center and uh, focusing on technology, lifestyle companies, as well as cybersecurity. And these are places where a company can start and grow. Continue to grow, right. They can go in uh, a co-working space, which we're in right now. They can go into a office environment or take multiple offices, which we have many tenants that have that as well. And Montgomery County really is a place that supports innovation and entrepreneurship, and it's great to see what's happening here in Rockville. It's really alive. You know, everybody knows about other innovation centers or in other parts of the country, but we have a very vibrant entrepreneurial community here. Uh, we are 100% full. We need more co-working and incubation space or innovation space for our companies at this time, but it's nice to have that problem. So one of the challenges that entrepreneurs sometimes have is access to capital. How does that being addressed here at BioHealth Innovation? Well, fortunately at the Rockville Innovation Center, we actually have a Latin American venture capital firm who decided to locate in Montgomery County versus San Francisco or Boston. They actually are incubating one of their funded companies in the Rockville Innovation Center and they're across the hall from each other, which is very convenient. And it's right here. Brace is funding their company. Brace Just... Pharma is funding Tyrogenics and they can look at each other across the hall. BioHealth Innovation really is about helping companies succeed. How can a life sciences company be successful right here in Montgomery County? Well, we're one of the most complete ecosystems for life science com companies in the country. We have the innovation and incubation space, and they can grow just like Revergen, where we're in their space today. We have innovation centers for wet labs if they need them in Germantown. And we have a talented team of entrepreneurs and residents that can provide the marketing and business support to the companies who generally have strong science, but need a little help in growing their businesses from a marketing perspective. And BioHealth Innovation pulls that all together for those companies. A complete ecosystem, a one-stop shop. Rockville is a perfect place for the Rockville Innovation Center because it's a complete ecosystem. We have shops, you have hotels, all right in Rockville, and you also you have access to public transportation at the Metro, which is less than a half a mile away from the Rockville Innovation Center. 
And it's really that next generation workforce, those millennials that want that connectivity and those quality of life features where they work. There's no question. They want everything focused around them so that they don't have to travel. It's a live, work, and play environment, self-contained right in Rockville in Montgomery County. Thank you so much for telling me more about BioHealth Innovation and showing me the Innovation Center here in Rockville. I had a great day. David, I had a great day too, and I think that we can do great things together between BHI and Montgomery County Economic Development Corporation. So let's look to the future and what we can build this economy. Absolutely. Let's partner to grow some business and do great things together. Thank Thanks, you. David. Thank you.